a people person and I'm always talking to everybody and you know, you see people, nobody's a stranger to me. I think that's kind of like when I bought my niche, you know, just sharing with them and um, it was it was just something that, you know, like I said, it was something that just happened. It wasn't that I wanted to go out and conquer the world, no, but it was just something that, wow, well, opportunity to present itself and it just felt right. I knew that it was what I needed to do. I had a daughter and my daughter died and I was very, very uh, distraught and you know, just kind of like was kind of giving up on life, and then you, you run into people, you see people, and they say to you, um, you know, you talk, and then you begin to share your story, they begin to share theirs, and it was like, wow, you know, okay. Um, you, I tell my story, then they tell of tragedies and things that have happened to them, and it seemed like it just felt right. You know, I didn't go out looking for it, but it's just something that just happened. And so from there, it kind of like snowballed. What we didn't see is a, a program that comes and uh, is for crime and different things in our area. So I know the uh, director of We Didn't See and have talked with her, you know, um, at some great names. And so she knew what I was doing. And so it kind of like, kind of like, again, snowballed. Um, I did a 30-hour practicum with the ARC House in my field, a, a human development field. And so the women were so, oh, they needed something. And they asked me, you know, would you come back? A 30-hour practicum turned into like 60-hour practicum. And now um, I'm going to be doing like once a week with these women. Some women are in abusive relationships. Um, some women just need to blow off some steam. Um, some women want to know about their careers. Um, you know, can I go back to school? Do you think this? And it's not so much as what I think. It's really just to empower them, to let them know, you know, you can do anything. If you put your mind to it, you know, you can do it. I've done it. I've come through some hard stages in my life, you know, and so I'd just like to share that with them that no matter what it is, you can do it. Give back. And mainly these women, um, have big hearts. They want to give back, don't know how to give back. So this is basically what, you know, I'm doing. Just giving back to them so they can pass it along to other people.